Okay, let's move on to the wiring. This unit came with this huge wiring harness here. Okay, a ton of connectors. They basically are pulling <laughs> three or four different voltages into the cab. They want you to pull this through the firewall. I have a little connector here. And, you know, just very complex setup, okay? And it doesn't have to be that hard. Let's make it simpler. Here are the components you have for the light bar assembly. So we're going to take this and just toss this stuff out. Okay. We've got the light bar here, okay, and you want to you want to have basically the light bar. Let me get this. There we go. You want the light bar to be hooking directly to your 12 volt. You can see that across here, this little green switch, okay. And what turns that green switch on and off inside this relay, okay, and this is standard relay with uh, four prongs on the bottom. What turns that on and off is the actuator coming into pin 85 on the bottom here, okay. So you wire. 12 volts to pin 30, your light bar to pin 87, hook him to ground through the chassis, and your chassis is going to take care of all your grounds here. Hook 86 to the ground, which is basically the back side of this, and you want to hook the ground pin to here. Now, here comes the fun part. <clears throat> You'll take and put a switch in line here, okay, and that switch needs positive voltage to turn this number 85 on and activate the relay and turn the voltage from 12 volts here to the light bar. So what we did is we took and put a switch in line, we put a diode, okay, so current will only go one direction, and we put a fuse so we don't screw anything up in the car, and then we hooked it to an ACC on the car. Now when we turn ACC on is the only time, or headlight, that this, this whole system can energize. You turn on the switch, it energizes 85, and 85 actually relays the voltage from 12 volts over to the light bar. Okay. You can see here, this is where we put the whole unit together. We've got the fuse. We put a little diode in there. We'll, we'll, we'll uh, shrink tube all this. Okay. And then your switch, this particular switch, uh, really clean looking here, okay, uh, on off, will also light up during when you press it on. Okay. So that's where we move over to. And so we'll take this and we'll hook it into the ACC. Okay. We'll hook it into ACC on the car. And how we'll do that is we'll use this thing called a posi tap. Okay? And these things are very cool little connectors. And what you do is you'll put this under the wire, put the wire between here, okay? And you'll just screw this posi tap on and it will tap into the car wire, okay? And then how do you connect the other end? This end here. Very simple, you just loosen this up. Okay, put your collar around here like this. And get him on there and screw him down onto here and there's another connector here so kind of expensive and difficult to find but these posi taps are amazing okay they work a hundred percent better than these old connectors which tend to fall off or they won't crimp all the way okay and the posi taps they come in lots of sizes too so you can get you can tap into you know into actually number 12 wire if you want or a smaller wire like a car these red ones here so let's take a look at the switch.